Lock up. Well, a short while ago, the Memphis City Council started digging into Mayor Paul Young's proposed budget and figuring out where to allocate the money. As well as how they feel about the mayor's proposed nearly 30% increase to the property tax rate, as well as hiking the fee for trash pickup. Our Jay Shakur has been listening in on today's hearing. And Jay, what have you learned so far? Richard Pepper, there's been a lot of talk of numbers and finance today, but what really stood out was Mayor Paul Young's new effort to fund MSCS. That's usually a role for the county and the state. The mayor requesting $15 million to fund infrastructure improvements for MSCS schools. Now, while none of the council members that sit on the finance committee appear to object to the proposal, some disagree on how that money should be spent. Some council members suggesting the money should instead go towards supporting after school programs or other things. Mayor Young is also proposing over the next five years, 60 million for MATA, 6.5 million for the library system, and 61 million over five years for police services. That isn't the entire police budget, but that's for equipment and software, with 54 million of that for suppliers of things like body cameras and tasers. Still, some council members want more specifics. Um, the burden of proof should be on the administration. You're asking us to support an additional, uh, it says $20 million in programming, but without um, a tangible plan for us to implement, if you want, you know, if you want the body to buy into something. Now, just a reminder, this is only just the beginning. There's a long, long way to go. We don't expect that the full council will vote on the final budget until sometime in late June. Live in downtown Memphis, I'm Jay Shakur.